New Orleans mayor says she would have cancelled Mardi Gras if administration had warned about coronavirus dangers. Note CDC was mostly quiet about potential for community transmission. They were also mostly quiet about impact that limited testing had on containment and surveillance. I don't have time to confirm now, but I think this was before the extremely limited nature of testing had been publicized. Up until this point, the relatively low number of tests was generally presented as evidence that coronavirus was mostly contained. Indeed, that's certainly the impression communicated from the CDC the day before Mardi Gras. New Orleanian here. Literally everyone in New Orleans the day before Mardi Gras is either, costuming furiously, seeing music and partying, already hungover, or passed out and resting for actual Mardi Gras day. Nuclear warfare could break out across the planet on Mardi Gras day and most of us wouldn't know it. Our Alabama governor today. We're not California, we're not New York, we aren't even Louisiana, Ivy said. A month from now equals well nobody told us that it was going to hit our state too. How come nobody warned us? Do you know what I learned about America this past month? It's that collectively, we are too fucking arrogant and unfeeling to think anything happening around the world could affect us. That poem about they came for X and I didn't speak up, and then they came for me and there was nobody left to speak for me is super fucking relevant to the US right now. It just sucks that the American people are going to die en masse due to unprecedented neglect, incompetence, and outright cruelty throughout our government. I will never again be proud to be an American. Never. So I know her personally, she was a regular at my bar, Latota is not a nice person, but she is competent. If she had cancelled Mardi Gras it's not just that she would have lost an election, she would have had death threats. Y'all need to understand how big of a deal Mardi Gras is to us, not just financially but culturally. In a final destination type way two people died during Mardi Gras from float accidents and still it was controversial how she limited Mardi Gras floats. If limitations or cancellation had happened because of Corona, when at the time we had no known cases, Latoya's head would be on a platter. Obviously looking back now Mardi Gras should have been cancelled but at the time the feds were still saying everything was okay. Keep context into consideration in the judgment of our mayor's leadership. Mardi Gras was over a month ago, February 25th. The NBA was filling arenas until March 11th. Most schools were full of children later than that. I don't remember any substantial number of people in the US worrying about it that far back. I agree that few people, certainly not me, were taking this seriously in February. That said, it's a pretty lame face-saving attempt. The mayor of NOLA would have cancelled Mardi Gras if Trump had told her to back in February. Pretty unbelievable.